Hello! In this video, you will learn how to integrate your Ledger Nano S or Ledger Nano X with the Yoroi Chrome Extension Wallet. If you wish to skip ahead to a certain part of the video, find the time guidelines below. First, you need to download and install Ledger Live and go to the Manager tab. Make sure you have connected your Ledger Nano device to your computer's USB port and unlock it. Next, navigate to the dashboard on your Ledger device. Allow Ledger Manager on your Ledger device. Next, check out that the Ledger device firmware version is 1.5.5 or higher. Now, search for the Cardano Ada app and press the Install button. You need to make sure that your device has enough space to store the Cardano Ada app. If you have too many apps on your Ledger device, you may get an error. Installation may take a few seconds. Now you have the Cardano Ada app installed on your Ledger device. Next thing you need to do is to go to the Chrome Web Store and search for Yoroi. Yoroi is a fast, simple, and secure light wallet created by Emergo. Emergo is one of the founding companies of Cardano that drives the adoption of Cardano by building, investing in, and advising projects. Make sure you are not downloading a fake app. Be sure to check that it is offered by Emergo and that the URL is correct. Now, press the Add to Chrome button and the Add Extension button. Now that Yoroi is installed, simply press the Yoroi icon at the top of your browser. Once you've selected your language and accepted the terms of use, the Cardano Payment URL setup page will be shown. Cardano Payment URLs allow you to easily share invoices with friends and businesses by simply clicking a URL. You can always enable or disable this feature from the Yoroi Settings section. If you want to enable URLs, press the Allow button, and again, press the Allow button in a pop-up dialog, and then press Finish. Or, if you want to disable Cardano URLs, press the Skip button, and then press the Confirm button. Now you are ready to connect your Ledger device. Select the Connect to Hardware Wallet section, then press the Ledger Hardware Wallet section. A Connect to Ledger Hardware Wallet pop-out will be shown. Go through all the prerequisites and then press the Next button. Make sure you have connected your Ledger device to the computer's USB port before pressing the Connect button. Once you have pressed the Connect button, you will be shown a new page where you can choose your Ledger device model, either the Ledger Nano S or the Ledger Nano X. We'll be showing both devices and the necessary actions on screen. Now, you have to perform some actions on your Ledger device. So, take a look at your Ledger device screen. If your Ledger device is locked, you need to unlock it first by entering your PIN, and then open the Cardano app by pressing both buttons on your Ledger device. You'll see a prompt on your Ledger device asking you to export public key. Press both buttons on your Ledger device. Now, the prompt Confirm Export Public Key will be shown on your Ledger. Press the right button on the Ledger Nano S or both buttons on the Ledger Nano X to confirm. And in the Yoroi interface, press the Save button. That's it. You have successfully connected your Ledger Nano S or X to Yoroi Wallet. Your funds will be automatically restored in Yoroi if you had previously used this device. Now, let's take a look at how to send a transaction. Note that the private key never leaves your Ledger device. Everything that happens from deriving addresses to sending transactions 
happens right on your Ledger hardware wallet. And that's what makes it so secure. Go to the Send tab. Paste an address of the receiver you want to send ADA to and enter the amount of ADA. Press the Next button and then press the Send Using Ledger button and make sure you've connected your Ledger device to the computer's USB port. You will be shown a new page. Press the Continue button. Now, you have to perform some actions on your Ledger device, so take a look at the Ledger device screen. If your Ledger device is locked, you will need to unlock it first by entering your PIN and then open the Cardano ADA app by pressing both buttons on your Ledger device. You will see a prompt on your Ledger device asking you to start new transaction. Press the right button on your Ledger device to confirm or both buttons on your Ledger Nano X. Next prompt will ask you to confirm sending ADA. Press both buttons on your Ledger. Then, to confirm the receiver's address, press again both buttons on your Ledger device. For Ledger Nano X, you must press the right button to scroll through the address and then press both buttons. Next, you will see a prompt asking you to confirm the transaction fee. Press both buttons. The final confirmation prompt will ask you to confirm transaction. Press the right button. Or on the Ledger Nano X, both buttons. The transaction is now sent. You can close your ROI by pressing the X button and reopen it at any time. Also note that there is no logout button and disconnecting the Ledger device will not stop you from opening your ROI. This is because, unlike other applications for crypto wallets, such as MetaMask, we do not inject JavaScript into other pages. Now we're going to show you how you can verify an address on your Ledger device. Go to the Receive tab. There, you will see an address that you can use to receive ADA. To verify that the address is legitimate, please press the Verify Address button. You will be shown a pop-up with the address and the key derivation path. To continue, press Verify on Hardware Wallet button. And make sure you have connected your Ledger Nano device to the computer's USB port. You will be shown a new page. Press the Continue button. Now, you have to perform some actions on your Ledger device, so take a look at the Ledger device screen. If your Ledger device is locked, you need to unlock it first by entering your PIN, and then open the Cardano ADA app by pressing both buttons on your Ledger device. You'll see a prompt on your Ledger device to verify your address. Press both buttons. In the next step, you will see some address derivation path and the address you had selected in your ROI to verify. You do not need to go back to your ROI and check it while verifying on the Ledger device. The address derivation path will be shown on your Ledger device. Make sure it is the same as shown on the new page. Once you have done this, press both buttons. Now, the actual address will be shown on your Ledger device. Make sure it's the same as shown on the new page. Once you have done this, press both buttons. For the Nano X, press the right button to scroll through the address and then press both buttons. You have completed this step.